Hi, so my name is Jonathan, and it's nice to see you all here. And the pandemic. I'm pretty sure everyone here has some kind of experience with it. And today, I want to say how it affected my life. It affected my life by turning it upside down. One way the pandemic did this was with my future. So since the pandemic happened when I was still in high school, like during senior year, I was locked down until like half the year. And I had already had a plan for my future. I was planning on joining the Marine Corps and then using those benefits to get through college without having to pay a fortune. But in my time of isolation in the pandemic, I was able to think about it a lot, probably way more than I should have. And it, it, I was able to realize that that wasn't what I wanted to do. But the pandemic also gave me the trouble that I wasn't able to figure out what I wanted to do. So I currently don't have a dream to pursue. I am still in college for engineering, but now I just see that as a backup, but I still look for the true passion that I want to do for my life. Although this has also given me a strange sort of freedom because I am no longer tied to just one path. I can finally like, I can take anything that life throws at me and experience it for what it is. So in a sort of way, it was a good and a bad thing that the pandemic ruined my plans. And this time in the pandemic also gave me some time to think about my family relationships. My family is separated by distance and the pandemic in a strange way has made our bonds even stronger. So during the pandemic, I had a strange relationship with my older brother, which during the course of the pandemic, I was able to patch up because of the things that happened during that time. So I was working with my father as construction, five days a week, the pay was bad, but it's a job. And my brother was important. So in that time, I realized how Holding a grudge against him was not a good thing for me or for anyone in my family. And I came to patch up with him. The pandemic also developed like a literal blow to my family. It almost took away the life of my mother, my grandmother, and my younger sibling. My, grandma had to, my grandmother had to be put in oxygen and I'm I'm glad to God that he, she was able to make it through. And talking about changing relationships, the perspective of relationship, I was also able to change my perspective on a lot of things. So during my time in isolation, I was able to think about all the things that I was still holding to after high school. There were a lot of things that I really wanted to keep but in the end it was just holding me back it was preventing me from turning a new leaf in the chapter of my life during that time of isolation i learned to be able to move on from it to let it go and to finally turn the page but i also learned to accept things that i just couldn't change there were some things that i wish i had done different events that I wish I had taken a different action, etc. And the pandemic in a good way affected that. I have a more positive outlook in life now. And saying it like this makes it seem that I'm putting all of this into steps, but in reality, all of this happened at the same time. It was all compacted during those six months of isolation. And to summarize how it changed my life, I wanna say that it changed my future, my perspective, and my family. The pandemic, for me, it changed my life a lot. And it's a good thing that I am able to reflect on it the way it did, because 
it gave me a new sense to what I am now. And I want you all to take your time to also reflect on it. Think about the ways it changed you, be it light hearted or quite somber. I want you to reflect on it and see how it changed you, be it physically or mentally. Thank you.